Hello everyone, this is Gorpa, and the game of the month June is Total War Rome 2, where we take a closer look at the Pirates and Raiders DLC. For those that don't know what this series is about, in the game of the month series I take one of my games and show you what the game is about, in the form of let's plays and if it applies, a walkthrough in my series Bought and Forgotten, so that you can get a good look of the game and what this game will offer you. So why Total War Rome 2 for this month? I promised some friends that I would return to Rome 2 once patch 12 has been released and when some driver issues that I had were fixed. So now they're fixed and patch 12 has been released and with the release of the Pirates and Raiders DLC uh, it felt like the right time to return to the game. In this month we will primarily focus on the Pirates and Raiders DLC so you can get a better look at what this DLC brings you while also showing you what the game Rome 2 is about. The Pirates and Raiders DLC has been developed by the Creative Assembly and published by Sega on the 29th of May and it's available for 7 euros 49 by a regional equivalent. Please take into account that the base game Rome 2 is needed for this DLC, which stand at the price of 54 euros 99 or the regional equivalent. I will make a walkthrough about the Pirates and Raiders DLC so that I can show you all the new things that are included in this DLC and this video will be released in the first week of June. While on each Monday and Friday I will release a let's play video where we will play as the Odrician Kingdom or Astillus in the Grand Campaign. I haven't decided yet on which faction. I will make a playlist for this month's game so it's easy watchable for you. I hope you will enjoy this month's game and would like to get your feedback about the format and the release schedule of this series. And you can do that through the comments, Twitter or by sending me an email. And the same goes for suggestions about the next month's game. If you wonder what games I own, well you can check that easily, because I made a google document with all the games in it that I own. Uh, check the description down below for all my contact information and the google document. Or check my steam profile where all steam games are listed. So thanks for watching, this has been Korpa and I'll see you next time.